What's going on, guys? And welcome back to Cyberpunk 2077. We are moving on after the little brain... Little catastrophe we was having last time with the Perez family and all that kind of stuff. We're currently waiting on... Oh, Judy's calling. Judy! Judy. So, you got a plan? Damn right, I do. Come over to mine tonight. Gonna lay the groundwork with Tom and Roxy. They're with us. Ooh. Michael will be here, too. How'd you manage that? Got something really big. Tell you everything tonight. Last thing, what do you like on your pizza? What do I like on my pizza? Locust pepperoni and an extra cheese. Locust pepperoni and lots of extra cheese. Atta boy. So, I'll see you come evening. You gonna tell me the big secret? You gonna tell me this big secret of yours? Figured out how to tweak behavioral chips. Turn dolls into fighters. Sounds like my kind of plan. Ooh. We'll go over the specifics tonight. You're coming, right? Of course I'll be there. All right. So as I was saying, last time we did the paralysis thing. Why is everyone running? What's going on here? Uh, did the paralysis thing, found out a little bit the 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 brain takeover. But I don't think that story arc's finished just yet, so we're going to see more of that. We could go and do Judy now, but also we could go and do the Nocturnal P55N1 and go and see Hanako at Embers. Um, obviously, we've still got some a lot of these side missions to do, but some of these are like go and pick something up, go and pick something up kind of thing. Head to this, go and do a street race. Um, I'm not really in doing like the, the street race stuff and just grabbing something just for the sake of it. Um, I want to mainly focus on the story arcs uh the expansion obviously the main stuff so i think what i might do i might go and see judy now and get deal with that so this i have a feeling this is kind of coming to a conclusion with judy um so let's head over to the revolution so she wants to kind of take over the the minds of these things that's going on at clouds right because she wants revolution against evelyn so let's head over to Judy. But like I said, hopefully you're having a good morning, afternoon, or evening. And let's start today's video by going say in hello to Judy. Did I not? Now I've marked it. Now let's go and see Judy. All right. So we're just pulling up to Judy's. Knock, knock. I like Judy as a character. She's pretty cool. She's upstairs, isn't she? I wonder if there's going to be uh, a funeral for Evelyn. Maybe. Because like everyone else that's kind of died within the story, even um, Scorpion, we never actually met, even had a funeral. I send off by sending him over the cliff, right? So. There's 10 to 12 hours in Dogtown. Okay. That's a lot though for expansion though, isn't it? Uh oh, Elizabeth. Uh oh. V, I know that I might seem like you're trying to help, but I'd rather that you just left us alone. Otherwise, things won't end well. Goodbye, V, and please stay away. You've done enough already. You have been blocked. Wh what? Kerry, where are you? Are they gonna respond? Kerry's the um the person that's in the band, right? Who we told not to be part of the band when we did the gig. Judy, it's only me. Hey, V. Come on in. Pizza's getting cold. What the? We're in the kitchen. Some of the world's latest snippets for a segment I call... You made it. Good. Grab a seat. This is Roxanne. She's worked at Clouds longer than any of us. Hello. Hello. Oh, that's Johnny over in the corner. Mormon families. Pizza! The government of the Republic hey, nice to meet you. When I heard what you pulled at Clouds, shit, I so regretted I was off that day. Just eat the free pizza and then we're out of here, okay? Manage. So then, what's the plan? Need to wait for Michael. Feeling better? You look better. I'm on autopilot. 
I don't think. Just do. Sound method. You'll never get rid of the stench of the corpse. Oh, look who it is. You drop a lot of them, don't you? What's your secret? Suddenly comes naturally to you, doesn't it? <laughs> yeah, odd. Given how much work I gotta put into it. By the way, Boris didn't show up for work today. Or yesterday. No shit, I wonder why. He's not coming back. Doubt I need to explain why to you. Me? I've got no idea why. Remember that. Done saying hello to each other? Revolution won't plan itself. I modified the behavioral chip. It can equip any doll with a motor reflex system. In other words, make the doll move and fight like a preem tier solo. Fascinating, isn't it? What one can learn while tuning fake orgasms for the moxes. Mind stepping outside? Can't smoke in here. You'll air it out later. Fine, I'll sit by the window. <laughs> The body will react as if executing a well-trained... Oh, yeah, there is a window over there. Already tested it out on top. Chip's impulses supplant any natural reflexes, so it'll make users feel like they're experiencing cyberpsychosis. But it's basically the same as when we activate ourselves for a client. Tech that's all pros and no cons, I don't buy it. Side effects, spill them. Combat mode auto initiates when a threat is present, and uh, there's no way to stop it. Oh, Can't God. find a workaround. And that's it. I don't know. Only way to determine that would be through months of testing on a range of subjects. There's an ethical side, too. You can murder someone and not remember a thing. So, all the dolls are going to go into like aggressive mode and <laughs> start attacking everything. How'd you ever come up with this? Learned how the behavioral chip works at Clouds. Always seemed like they must be pretty easy to modify. I'm surprised I didn't get the idea the moment we walked into Maiko's office. Count yourself lucky. What with all the cams and mics and Clouds? Tiger Claws would sooner dig those chips out of the dolls with screwdrivers than let an idea like this run its course. Don't make trouble. All right. Gotta see it to believe it. Finally. Someone said it. Tom? All right. Pulled that sequence from a kung fu training virtue. Yeah, I'm not convinced. If I'm to count on ninja dolls, I'm gonna need to see some real action. <laughs> like, wanna spar? What else? Just don't mess up my digs, okay? I like it here. I'm not gonna lie. I totally forgot how to pull out my fists. I think I might have changed the key binds for my fists. I'm 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 trying to my hands aren't working right now. <laughs> I totally forgot how to use combat. I don't use my fists for anything. Have I changed the have I changed the combat thing? Because normally I would pull out my blades, my monster's blades right now. I'm being spoon, aren't I? It's on now. Never mind. Let's walk up to him. <laughs> Everything chill? You okay? <laughs> Look at me go! You see that? Okay. <laughs> just walk Whoa. up to him. I was there I'm just there trying to get my fists out. <laughs> <laughs> nice work, Judy. Outdid yourself. If you were to sell that, you'd be the richest Judy in the NUSA. Please. Plenty of killing machines in the world. I don't want to turn more people into them. After this, chips are getting micro nuked. If you got something to say, just say it. Who, me? 
This is my impressed face. Okay, okay. That probably sells it. The chip works. Let's get to it then. You've got an elite force of three muscle heads and a techie. What now? Guards and tiger claws in and around will overpower. Take down, disarm, escort them out. Clouds will be ours. Bosses, we'll give an ultimatum. A cut of the proceeds in exchange for never showing their faces at the club again. And having no say in how the club's managed. That's what I thought. A half-baked, insane plan. You can't see more than an inch ahead of you. Taking out the security there won't solve anything. Claws will just send more. Hiromi Sato is the man you gotta get to. Hiromi Sato? Who's that? Cloud's real boss. He rarely shows, but you can't so much as sneeze without him finding out. Claws trust him, respect his opinion. He is one of them. We can try to convince him, but it's doubtful. We stand a better chance by injecting him with a dose of fear. Where do we find this, Hiromi? At his apartment. H8 Mega Tower. Topmost floor. It's a penthouse. Almost never steps outside its glass walls. But I'll figure out a way to get us inside. Tom and Roxanne gonna come with? No. Hole points to strike both places at the same time. They'll take care of business at Clouds. Two-pronged assault. Loving it. It's just my work. If we get him in his apartment, where he thinks he's completely safe, bosses will understand what we're looking to demonstrate. My, my. There's a flickering in that skull sponge of yours after all. So how about it, V, Tom, Roxy? Made up your minds? I... I need to think about it. Never wasted anyone before, you know. I'm with it all the way. V? Don't tell me you're seriously considering this. Sticking our precious necks out for a bunch of whores? Why not? Count me in, Judy. I already said I'd help, didn't I? Thanks, V. Save the gratitude for later, please. I'll set up the meet with Hiromi and let you know. I need a couple days. Have fun. Toodaloo. Toodaloo. Michael, hold up. Give us a lift. Only if you don't talk to me. I feel a migraine coming on. Oh, shit. I'm scared, V. Speaking of gratitude, stuff I'm asking you to do, well, usually comes with a price tag, I know. You want to help, I get that. But I'm more than happy to pay your fee in full. Feels like it's only right. All right. Thanks. Nice of you to think of that. Ah, uh, don't mention it. Uh-oh. Uh, uh, v, everything okay? Here we go again. V, you don't, you don't look, look so hot. Uh, uh, okay. Okay, I'm better. I'm fine. What the hell, V? You, like, sick? Remember the heist Evelyn hired us for? The relic I was gonna clep. <sighs> Couldn't forget that in a million years. That biochip. Well, long story short, it had Johnny Silverhand's mind on it. An engram of it that's overriding my mind. You being serious? Truly wish I wasn't. Mm -hmm. Fuck. <laughs> Anything at all you can do? One can hope. It's late. You're tired. You can crash on my couch if you want. Sure. Sounds great. Thanks. Don't worry about it. Make yourself at home. Oh. What's going on? Again, kidding. <laughs> 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 
Eat breakfast, optional. Oh, interesting. Place looks like a fucking antique museum. Then I guess you should feel right at home. Chick's got taste. That all you have to say? And she's nice. Six out of ten. <laughs> Didn't know she dabbled in robotics. Now that's fucking Shimra. Think that's how she winds down? After a day's work of tuning hardcore smut? Wouldn't be surprised. Breakfast done. Time to head out. I've just got a message from uh, Thingy as well. Quite a few messages, to be honest. Jefferson Perales. Oh, God. What is all of this? V, I spoke with Elizabeth. She, she confirmed what you told me. How long has this been going on for? I can't remember when this could have started. But that's just it, isn't it? I can't even trust my own memories. Who knows how much of this is fake? I remember my brother, I think. It's hard to say why he's suddenly in my memories. Elizabeth showed me that room you two found. What the fuck is going on? I feel like I'm not in control of anything anymore. Uh, they were in my home. My home, for fuck's sake. I won't sleep until I catch these mother truckers. Um, no, they weren't just in my home. They were... They mean they were here too. Just already know about it. Good luck. Uh, morning, sleepyhead. Had to run. Didn't want to wake you. Uh, left you some breakfast. Eat up. Cool. That's already been eaten. Hey, got your number from a friend. Heard you're good at what you do. If that's a good honest truth, then I've got a gig for you. Call me if you're interested. Who the hell's this? It's V. Heard you had a gig for me. You heard right. I need a driver. <laughs> mm -hmm. And for what exactly? Oh, you know, this and that. I got a few errands to run. A couple of friends that need paying a visit. The usual. Listen, I'm a straight shooter. So let me cut right to the chase. I heard you're the best in town. Thing is, I like working with the best. And I know the best don't come cheap. I'm not gonna get into the nuts and bolts, cause if what they say about you is true, you can handle anything. So let's get this settled. You got what it takes? Or are they wrong about you? All right, I'm in. Japan town, then. By the market entrance. Give a few honks and I'll stroll up. Later, V. Later. Jefferson Perales. Um, Eric, contact not found. So he's blocked me as well. Does that mean I'm not going to get paid? Uh, Judy Haver, I wanted to thank you again, uh, you know, for helping me with clouds. Don't want to think about anything happening, if it can happen there anyway. I think I got something that might help us. Can't go into the deets here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We've already kind of done that. Nancy Hartley, Samurai. It's about the concert V. We need to talk. Don't worry. It's all good news. These are just old messages now. Kerry. Uh, holy shit. Uh, Henry's on board. Way to go. Check out the rehab. Uh, check out rehab on his own free will. Okay. Judy. Hey, buried Ev today. Well, there you go. That's off. Today, Columbia near Darth Oak. I thought you might want to know. Did I miss that? Cybercast Psychosis, Rogue, Movie Night, forgot to tell you, swing by in the evening, got another things on my plate right now. Okay, Regina and Initiation as well. Okay. Cool. Let's leave the building and go and play with some dolls, I guess. A shame my in-game payments don't count to the thumb of on timer. Send in the clown. So this is this guy. Coin operated boy. Wait, where's... I guess we go and do this send in the clowns thing. Don't know why, but the sound of it gets creepy. Circus music stuck in my head. Maybe the dude was an acrobatic lion tamer or some shit. Never know in this city and we won't be able to call him. Okay, let's go and do this. Is this him? What hey, the? Your V, yes? Oh, fuck. You didn't answer my question. Yeah, that's me. Good. Then let's go. Where'd Sue? 
Little China. I have a craving for Kung Pao chicken. Extra spicy. Huh. What the? Where are we going? He actually looks like what? a clown, but I can't tell because it's a little bit dark you know, inside the car. The one on your face? Uh, you get used to it. I just gotta be careful not to pull the pin when I want to pick my nose. He's got a grenade in his face? Oh, I need to see this. Brazil is. <laughs> you never know with you gringos. Tiger claws. Heard of them? <laughs> Who hasn't? Got any friends in there? No, why? Just asking. Can't help being curious. What are you about to do? This is the place. Wait for me here and keep the engine running. We came all this way to get takeout. You could say that. He has got your name in his face! Uh, I can't change camera angle right now, so... I'm kind of stuck here. I guess we're just waiting. <laughs> what the? What just happened? What the fuck was that? You got grenades up your ass too? You got bloody cops on me now? What the hell have you got me into? Planet from the get go. That's <laughs> true what they say. You're good. Really fucking good. Got a stick up your ass, though. This is where we part ways. Good luck, V. And, uh, relax a bit, okay? Now, are you gonna tell me about the grenade? Oh, that. My brother ripped it off during a fight. With pliers. Ooh, one happy family. You don't know the half of it. I could have chipped another one, but... I don't know. I think this matches my style more. Uh-huh. Besides, it's a real icebreaker with the ladies. Got me powder for my nose. <laughs> and? Does it work? Not really. What about my payment? What about it? Here. Like I said before, the best don't come cheap. Take care, V. Four Gs. And hey... Keep your nose to the ground. Interesting. Rebel, rebel, rebel. Go to the meeting point between 12.30 and 3.30 a.m. Wait, who's this for? The love crisis or whatever. This drinks me a thing, but I don't know one thing. And carries... 
Go to the meeting between 12.30 and 3.30 a.m. This is for Kerry. Is he going to try and murder me in the morning or something? So we rise at this meeting point, 12.30, 3.30am. Now it's just a matter of waiting. Wait for good old Kerry. Let's see what he wants to do. hell is this piece of shit? Soon as I saw you that time, I thought to myself, those are some balls on that one. And I definitely need someone with a pair for this job. Never mind the testicles. Tell them to keep those hands attended to. Always wound up in a ditch whenever Carrie drove. These your wheels? God, no. Come on. <laughs> Borrowed it. So no loss if we wreck it. That's the plan. Fuck. Knew it. So what good will my balls do us today? V. Some people in this town, they've gone completely whacked. You, you're gonna help me set things right in this shithole we call home. Uh-huh. How's that exactly? Yeah, there's this little girl group. Us cracks, right? Three birds from Japan. Laser pop, Scott. Eh, yeah, big over in Asia. I mean, pff, who isn't? Now they signed some deal for an NUS tour. Want to promote it with a cover of my song. Can you believe that? Not about to let them play me like that. Right. So, what's the plan? The truck with the Us Cracks kid will be coming this way. Got a tip. We do it old style. Like last century. We blow the fucker up. No gear. Those bitches will have to cancel concerts. Kerry solving his own problems. He used to just send in an army of lawyers. They made it all disappear while he tanned his bare ass by the pool. Must be some fuckery indeed. Be there in a sec. Bloody hell. Shit ass little putt putt. Hey, Seaman. Here we are. Alright, what, what are we doing? Trunk. Grab what's in there. You got it. You know, they killed Ivy Coma right here. In this very spot. DJ. Cloaked AV followed her limo. Almost nothing left of her afterwards, or her limo. Turned out later she wasn't the target. Some biotechnica suit busy eating her out when the bullets started flying. Found the bodies just like that. Why don't we just get a stinger and grenades? What are we doing, Carrie? Lay it out here. Right. Hide. Quick. I'll be on this bush. Nobody will see me. I'm gonna hide with you. What now? Now we wait. Whoever's driving that truck, 
They armed, maybe? Got any hustle? Fuck, V. Honestly? No idea. Hope whatever happens, you'll be able to handle it. Playing by ear, huh? Wouldn't be my first time. Here we go. There she is. Right on the dot. <laughs> Johnny. I take the driver. You get his side shoe. We want him out of the truck. Sure you two, you what? Know what you're doing. The hell was that? Out of the truck! On the ground! Hands where I can see him! Get out! Ground! Now! Hey, man, listen! On the ground, I said! What are we stealing, Gary? Let's talk it out. Not a word. It'll all be over soon. Oh, fucking hell. Access guard! Grab it! Pop the back. Quit squirming. And no gonk moves. What's inside? Keep Are you shut, seriously? Jinx. No chat. Your lucky day, Care. Crates and crates of nothing but gear. Got your mixers, speakers, drums, cables by the mile. Hell yeah, we got a hit. Right, gents. Now, run along and don't look back. I said, Delta the fuck off. Now for the grand finale. Want this set to be a smoldering puddle of chrome and plastic when we're done. Ah, the new signature move. Mm-hmm, you got it. So don't miss. <laughs> Fuck yeah! Good working with you, V. Fuck me, Carrie. Meaning it's just a truck of toys for some plastic Japanese dolls. Might as well blow up a cotton candy stand. But still a big step forward. I hardly recognize the bastard. Scared two chooms shitless. Flamed a truck. Trying to be the next Johnny Silverhand, Carrie? Play terrorist? Next me? Ha, please. Carrie's got a short fuse, sure. But ain't no dynamite in that soul. You always oversimplify shit? Nuance, V. You say vandalism, I say artistic protest. Hmm. And the real reason? If those little bitches think they can make it big on my song, they got another thing coming. You even know what I had to sacrifice to get where I am? The price I paid for success? And those ten any whores wanna clip my tune and expect me to just let them? Fucking pig ignorant hacks. Yeah, success. Always a sore spot of cares. See, nothing's changed. <laughs> That's how you do biz in Night City. Respect, care. You get me. Finally. Thanks. Cops. Oh shit. It's Delta. You drive. Get him off our ass. In this piece of shit? Code zero. I repeat code zero in this area. All units resume normal duties. Oh. Reports have confirmed suspect is still in the area. Oh shit! Last time I ran from the cops back in 2020 with Johnny, actually. High out of our damn mind. Pig still couldn't catch us. <laughs> These gogs don't stand a chance. Fucking pigs! They're not even here. <laughs> yeah, well, don't pop the champagne yet. Still riding our asses. So we lose them. The Easy. quicker the better, too. I'm starving. Did they even get involved? Lost him. Super easy. Ah, paying out the ass for you. But it was worth every eddy. I don't nice. think that mission's technically to correct after the police eddy. new wanted system. Okay. Maybe. Drop me off on Carnitas. 
Because if, if you remember back before, like, 1.5 and stuff, wouldn't that mission randomly just spawn the police around you anyway? Where now the new wanted system kind of, like, brings them to your location and they search for you and stuff. So back then it would have made sense, but now it doesn't make sense. So that mission needs a bit of a tweak, right? Yeah, it was brutal before because, like, you could even hide in a store, right? And the cops will come off. You can still kind of do that now. But no cops even turned up there. It's like when I when I got into the car, he said I lost them. Then apparently they was back on me again. Which is super strange. Carry uridine eats at a dump like this. Chumbada. Best coffee in town right here. Thick as tar, and if they know you, they give you the Ganic stuff. Come on, my treat. Wow, coffee with a rock star. Now why not? First time for everything. And he's a little shipmobile. <laughs> when Samurai started out, we spent every any we had on guitars, strings, you know. Hey, Rachel! Good morning. Know this dump. Know that smell. But how? Hi, you uh, looking for someone? What are we eating? Uh, I had almost nothing left over for food. But we still went across the street every day, right to Caliente. Stuffed our faces, down Joe by the gallon. Johnny said we were so hungry and high we would have eaten the cardboard boxes out from under the bums outside. Of course he was wrong. The usual, Mr. Eurodyne? Mm-hmm. Double espresso, Jamaican blend, nothing else, no sugar. You got it. And for you? Uh, what he's having. Great. Be right back with it. So the horse blinders. Oh, shit. Just coming down now. Whoo. Fucking awesome. Last time I felt like this was back in Memphis. Last tour, last concert vibes from the crowd, me on stage. Oh, fuck. Just thought about those us cracks cunts again. You think we got them? They really got to you, didn't they? That was quick. Oh. Look at this. Unlistenable. That trash is their biggest hit. Fuck. Anyone could churn out hits like that. Even you. Honestly, to me this all stinks of one big media play. No, not it at all. Come on. Somehow you know where what to find that? a gear truck of some Asian dolls doing a cover of your song. Juicy little scandal for the media. Best case scenario, you know the game they're playing. Worst, they're playing you. Ah, fuck. Sure hope you're wrong. Because otherwise Johnny would have been right. From the get-go. What's Johnny got to do with any of this? Well, Johnny accused me of leaving Samurai for money and fame. But that's not true. No, no, it's true. Won't lie. But he also said I'd be putting myself on a corp leash. And that's not something you'll admit to. The us cracks thing. What if I'm a product just like those dolls? Drowning in dirty money instead of swimming in it. Hold on. I'm just putting my watch on. Please hold. Okay. Look, 
It's not like we know each other that well, but trust me, you got a rocker's soul and rocker's balls. <laughs> Thanks. Rocker's balls. The city doesn't forgive. It eats people alive. But you, well, you survived. Never thought about it that way. You may be right, man. <sighs> Better be going. Thanks for, uh, you know. Don't mention it. You're welcome. Coffee tastes like shit, by the way. <laughs> 